Hi everyone, this is Deborah. I just got finished mowing and weed whacking my yard and it just came to be that a lot of you all probably think I'm a girly girl, but I'm not. I have work boots on on most days and uh, definitely not a girly girl. I don't have those crazy freaking eyelashes. I like the natural look as, as most as I can get it. I don't wear fake fingernails. I, I don't like to be bound by something that makes me have to leave the house and spend money on, right? <laughs> so yeah, I, uh, I gotta go to Walgreens and pick up my meds and uh, so I do have to cover up some spots on my face. My dermatologist says I need a CO2 laser because I have some spots on my face that are questionable. I don't know, I have to talk to my doctor. Uh, okay, so. Ah! Oh my God, I have to put a fan on me because I'm so hot. So those lantern back uh, bugs have destroyed my plant. They say if you see one, send send a picture to the county extension agent and kill it after you take a picture of it. So, yeah, I found one on my porch just a minute ago. Ah, uh, yeah, they've ate up my my flowers. Oh my god. So the baby mom is pregnant again. Oh my God. And we think she's going to have the babies underneath my car. I don't know. She had her other babies underneath the porch. <sighs> but whatever. I really like where I live. I can stay out of everybody's business and they better stay out of mine, right? <laughs> oh my God. So it's rained here for, I, I believe, 12 straight days, and I am not exaggerating. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah, I'm not exaggerating. So my son spent the night here and he could not sleep. So he comes downstairs and tries to sleep in my living room. And of course the neighbors start to mow in the grass because it's the only day we have because uh, it's going to rain the rest of the week. I kid you not. So, I said, Mom, let's, let's start mowing. Okay. Uh, all right, let's start mowing. So, he, he helped me mow and he didn't feel like working today. That's not like him. He's kind of upset. Um, something's always going on, you know, in every family. There are family members who try to control you. There's family members who, uh, I don't know. It's awful. I say just let everybody do what the hell they want, right? Huh. Yeah, my son asked me why, when did I leave home? I said, when my mother sicked my two sisters on me and they were beating on me and I didn't fight back. Let me tell you how I fight back. I went in my bedroom, put my Mustang keys in a pocket of a floor length um, bathrobe, was completely dressed underneath and I left and I never went back. I got myself emancipated and then I became my own adult. You don't stay in a toxic house, people. 
you don't stay in a toxic house. If my father had a seen that, he would have beat the shit out of those three. Not saying that he's ever hit, you know, my sisters as an adult, as a teenager, but let me tell you what, if he had seen that, and I never told my father that, I don't know, I don't think I ever did. Maybe I should have. There are reasons why people leave a house. They just don't up and leave for no reason, honey. So, yeah. There's so many things I've not shared with you guys, but I'm gonna start because for some reason, I think I'm not gonna be on this earth much longer. Yeah. Bye.